welcome to Pollywog Lagoon. I'm Felina the Mermaid. I like to read stories and play with toys with all of my favorite characters. I hope you enjoy my video, and please feel free to subscribe. Hi there! Today we're going to be reading the Shimmer and Shine book, Monster Magic. And we have Shimmer and Shine and Leah, along with the Emoji Movie Crew joining us. And you see the jack-o'-lantern and the spooky ghost. And this prickly little goofy-eyed spider. Hope you're ready to have some fun. Let's get started. Okay, guys, before we read this super fun book and have some fun, go ahead and hit the red subscribe button. That way you can see more videos coming really soon. Thanks so much. Shimmer and Shine, a big golden book, Monster Magic. Adapted by Kristen L. Depkin. Based on the teleplay, A Very Genie Halloween by Whitney Fox and illustrated by Dave Aikens. One day, Shimmer and Shine were in their kitchen decorating cakes. Frosting is my favorite part of cake, said Shimmer, licking a spoon. Just then, their bracelets started to glow. Shimmer and Shine, my genies divine, through this special chant, three wishes you'll grant, said a voice. It was their friend... Leah! Your best friends are on the way. Shimmer and Shine jump onto their magic carpet and took off! Poof! The genies appeared in Leah's living room and landed inside a giant cauldron full of candy. I don't know what you're up to, Leah, said Shine, but this night is off to a great start. It's Halloween! You guys are going trick-or-treating with me, Leah announced. Shimmer frowned, but wait, people might see that we're genies. Leah shook her head. Mm -mm. That's what's great about Halloween. No one will know you're real genies. They'll just think you're wearing genie costumes. She handed each of them a jack-o'-lantern pail for collecting candy. Come on, guys. Let's trick-or-treat Zach's house first. When the friends arrived at Zach's, he was dressed up as a spider attached to a web. I got a little crazy with the glue, and now I'm stuck, he explained. It happens. Happens a lot. Shimmer, Shine, and Leah... Pulled Zack down. Oh, oh. Leah introduced him to the genies. Those are some great genie costumes, said Zack. Zack was excited to show Leah and the genies his haunted house creations. He pointed to a graveyard filled with boxes. Here lie the tombstones of haunted delicious pizzas. He continued the tour, bringing his friends over to a large kitchen pot. And here is the witch's cauldron for brewing magical potions and bobbing for apples. But Zack didn't have any apples, so he had to fill the pot with potatoes. Potatoes? Oh. Zack had even put a mask on his dog's face, turning Rocket into the scariest werewolf ever. But he had saved his spookiest surprise for last. Prepare yourselves. The monster that lies ahead is sure to spook you out of your socks, he warned. Ooh, spooky. Behold, Frankenstein! Zack shined his flashlight on a figure in the corner. I borrowed my grandma's plastic Santa, and I painted it green. Leah and the genies were impressed. I hope it's enough to win the best haunted house contest, Zack said. But just to make sure, I'm going to check out the other houses. He wished Leah, Shimmer, and Shine a happy Halloween, then headed down the street. Zack didn't realize that as he left, he bumped into a sack of jack-o'-lanterns, and they toppled to the ground. Oh, no! and rolled across the yard, knocking into the other decorations and ruining his haunted house. Oh no, cried Leah. He worked so hard to get ready for the contest. If only we could help him. Shimmer smiled. You can make a wish. For my first wish, I wish for Zack's house to be decorated. Boom, Zarame, first wish of the day. Shimmer used her genie magic to decorate Zack's house like a big birthday cake. Um, I wanted it to be spooky, said Leah. Not yummy. Oh, candy corns! My mistake! Leah used her second wish to fix Shimmer's mistake. I wish Zack had a real haunted house. Boom! Zarame, said Shine. Second wish of the day. She turned the cake decorations into spider webs, skeletons, bats, and other super spooky objects. <gasps> ah! Now this is more like it, said Leah. Zack's definitely going to win the haunted house contest now. Especially with the monster, exclaimed Shine. Um, what monster? Asked Leah nervously. Mm. 
The one right behind you, yelled Shine. A huge Frankenstein monster emerged from the shadows, and the friends hid in a giant cauldron. The monster groaned and started walking towards them. Why, is a real live walking and moaning Frankenstein coming out of Zack's house? Leah asked. You wanted a real haunted house, so I gave you a real monster, Shine said. I wanted Zack's house to look haunted, not be haunted. My mistake, Leah, said Shine. It's okay, Shine, said Leah. Mistakes happen. We just have to figure out what to do so Frankenstein doesn't find us. Shimmer snapped her fingers. I've got it. Maybe he won't see us if we don't move. Shine shook her head as the monster came closer. Nope, he sees us. The monster marched around the yard, stomping on pumpkins and laughing at the squishy sound they made. Hey, Frankenstein's not scary. Leah smiled. He's actually kind of adorable. Frankenstein beamed. Hi, me Frankenstein, the monster said. This is awesome, said Leah. Zack's got a great shot at winning the haunted house contest now. Yeah, he's got a real monster and spider webs and fog. Shine started the cough. <coughs> well, maybe a little too much fog. I got you covered, sis, said Shimmer. She conjured a handheld vacuum cleaner and sucked the fog out of the air. There, the fog is all gone. Shine gasped. <gasps> and so is Frank. The girls looked to see where the monster was. <laughs> he was halfway down the street, stomping on more pumpkins. Oh, lots of squishies, Frankenstein giggled. Squish, squish, squish. We have to get him back before anybody realizes he's a real monster, said Leah. She and the genies ran down the street in search of Frankenstein, but all they found was a monster mess. Then Leah noticed piles of squished pumpkins with giant footprints in them. Frankenstein left a trail, she exclaimed. If we follow it, we'll find him. The girls followed Frankenstein's messy trail. Wait, Leah said after they had passed a bunch of squished pumpkins and overturned trash cans. We can't just leave everything like this. We have to clean up Frank Monster's mess. I was hoping you'd say that, said Shimmer. She made her handheld vacuum appear once again. I love cleaning. The friends worked together to restore Zack's neighborhood. Soon the neighborhood was clean again, and everyone's spooky decorations were back in place. Guys, look, cried Leah. How nice the place looks, Shimmer nodded proudly. I know. It's beautiful. Well, it is beautiful, but I mean, look over there. It's Frank. The giant monster was heading down the street. Shine tried to stop him, but he wanted to keep smashing pumpkins. Frank, see more squishies, he giggled. I wish we could just stop Frankenstein, said Leah. Boom, Zarame, third wish of the day, chanted Shimmer. Shimmer and Shine, stop Frankenstein divine. That's my last wish, cried Leah. She hadn't meant to make her third wish, but it was too late. Shimmer used her magic to create a giant sticky web. Oh. Uh, Shimmer, what is that, asked Leah. A way to stop Frank, Shimmer grinned, just like you wished for. Leah shook her head. Uh, but there's no way a spider web is going to stop a guy with monster muscles. Oopsie. Since it stopped Zack, I thought it would work on Frank. Shimmer hung her head. My mistake. Actually, it was my mistake for making the wish, Leah told the genie. But we can't let it stop us, even if we don't have a way to stop Frankenstein. Leah hoped she was wrong, and that the magical spider web would catch the massive monster. But Frankenstein walked through the web as though it were cotton candy. Just then, Frankenstein noticed that a spider from Shimmer's web was on his shoulder. Do, 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 do. He jumped down in terror. Frank no like spiders, he cried. It's okay, Frank said, Shine, flying over to the monster. You don't need to be scared of this little guy. He's nice. Frankenstein stopped. Spider, it's friend, he asked. Shimmer, your mistake worked, said Leah. You got Frankenstein to stop. Then she had an idea. Maybe we can use the spider to get Frank to follow us back to Zack's house. What do you think, spider? Will you help us? <laughs> oh, thank you. Leah's plan worked. A few moments later, Frankenstein was safely back at Zack's house. He even played with his new spider friend. I might not know how to explain Frankenstein to Zack, laughed Leah, but I'm still glad he's here. Suddenly, Zack ran up the street with a trophy in his hand. I won the best haunted house contest, he said excitedly. That's great, Zack, Leah said, congratulating her friend. Zack grinned from ear to ear. Yeah, they said I had the best monster on the street. Then Zack saw Frankenstein. Whoa, I don't remember my green Santa looking like this, he shrugged. But it's Halloween, spooky things happen. A lot. Come on, Frank. Let's pass out some candy. When Zack and Frankenstein were gone, Leah thanked Shimmer and Shine for their help. 
even with the mistakes we made today, this was my favorite Halloween ever. Mine too, said Shimmer. We got to meet Frankenstein and decorate. We are two lucky genies. Leah hugged the two genies as they got ready to go home. We fixed our mistakes and our day turned out great. Boom zarame. Shimmer and Shine hopped onto their magic carpet and soared off, counting down the days until the next Halloween. Back in Zarame Falls, Shimmer and Shine finished decorating their cake. Lucky for them, they had one more pair of hands to help. Frank all done, announced Frankenstein as he revealed his creation, a giant pumpkin-shaped cake. Oh! Shine took a bite. Well, Shimmer, you were right. Frosting really is the best part of cake. The friendly monster took a giant bite of his cake. He thought the frosting was the best part, too. The end. Thanks so much for joining us for story time with Shimmer, Shine, and Leah, this prickly little spider, the Emoji Movie Crew, Jack O' Lantern, and Spooky Ghost. While we read Shimmer and Shine Monster Magic. We'll see you again real soon. Bye bye!